My name is Pim van Riel and I'm the chassis and overall tech manager at Yuri. Basically, I'm responsible for the structural monocoque of the car, uh, as well as the rest of chassis. So this includes the roll hoops, the firewall, the steering system. And I'm also re responsible for the overall tech department who double check uh, all the different designs that are made uh, by the team, as well as the overall planning of the car. How do you build a car? It's quite complicated. Uh, there's quite a lot of different subsystems within the car. So basically it all starts off with having an overall concept of what you want to do. Once there's a general direction for the team, uh, the new designs are made. We have a design freeze on the December 1st, uh, which means that all the different mechanical parts have to be designed. These designs are then thoroughly checked by the overall tech department for interactions between different parts, between different subsystems. And once that's done, we actually start producing it. So then all the different technical drawings are sent to production partners. We try to do a lot ourselves. Also, the electronics get sent to our partners. Then you start integrating all the different parts together. So you form the subsystems, you go to larger assemblies you test them individually. Currently, we do have some issues. We don't have carbon fiber for our monocoque, which means it's also quite hard to do destructive tests on test panels to see how strong our layups within the car are. We wanted to have the car finished on the 1st of May. Currently, we're looking more like halfway June, end of June. It's quite stressful because the team is depending on you to figure out how to, uh, to fix this problem. I'm Stan. I joined this team four years ago. I stayed with the team as an alumnus and I tried to help them wherever I could, solving problems, helping with testing days, giving advice. Yuri came with their technical problems, but also their organizational problems. And then we also invited some experienced people from CPP, from Canon, to think along with these problems, help the team solve them. Canon provided uh, workshops together with the team to basically think on issues we have within the team and how to solve it. Due to my experience within URI, I know what kind of problems um, the, the board runs into. Regularly, I sit down with someone from the board, ask them what kind of problems are you facing, and try to think about how did we tackle those problems before. Also, try to come up with creative ideas on how to solve these problems. Can't build the car alone as a board, so the rest of the team also helps out quite a lot during the week. But also we have things called production weekends. This basically means that we can do a lot within that one weekend because we have around 30 people helping out. We still have quite some work to do for the production part, but it should be finished in around two weeks. And once that's done, we can continue to the testing phase. We have a few different ways that we produce things. We have EPC, which is Equipment and Prototyping Center, uh, here on campus. EPC really helps us by having short ties to our race team. We regularly walk by to check up on progress if the drawings we made are up to spec. So uh, you really watch along the entire production process of parts, uh, which means that you also know what went wrong and where we can improve. We really were there every step along the way. That was a, a big learning experience. And everything we can't do ourselves, we send to production partners, such as Canon Production Printing. Some of the components that Jury really needs for its, uh, its race car are developed by the production facilities uh, that Canon has. Last time we saw each other, you were talking about a problem about carbon fiber. So what is the current situation about that? Yeah, the monocoque is finished. 
we looked together with the entire board which carbon fiber we were gonna get. Unfortunately, we didn't finish everything before the Christmas break. We had a delay of one month before we could start laminating the monocoque. It went quite smoothly and uh, we had it finished by uh, March 12th. The overall tech department and Canon helped think with the board uh, on how to tackle the issue and also helped uh, making sure we get finished on time by giving advice but also physically helping with the production. Jury and Canon benefit from each other since they share a lot of the same challenges. These range from acquiring new talent, so acquisition, to working with partners, trying to get all the uh, goods that you need. By sharing these experiences, I think both companies or both organizations can learn a lot from each other. Before my board here at Jury, I didn't have any experience doing anything like this. I basically get to learn a lot of managing skills in a work-related environment, so it's still with a lot of students, it's still uh, a lot of fun.